what's going on everyone this is chance and in today's video i've got a special tour for you i know the sun's not in the best position but as i walk and walk around here i'm going to talk about what's going on this is a home by franklin but one cool thing they was just telling me about this house it was built as handicap accessible so i know a lot of times y'all are always commenting and asking about that so like we've got extra wide doors you'll see the shower and stuff like that a lot of cool features now obviously you could order this house without all of that but uh it's pretty cool it's pretty cool to be able to see and i know i get questions about that all of the time so as we step around here you can tell we've got the porch this is at florida modular homes this is their saint augustine location they've got a couple different locations uh one in middleburg and then this one here in saint augustine we've got uh, so we got our tankless water heater there your outside plug water faucet there we have these amazing doors off the back i could just imagine having this porch over here and then having like a back deck maybe it be maybe it not be covered and so huh i think you'd have it all right then wouldn't you say down on that end i'm gonna hit that from the other side because it's really muddy back here but we got a, a plug there and then we got one down there as well and let me give you a shot of this siding the sun's hitting a lot better over here than it is actually on the front so let me show you the, the whole home is this a uh, hardy right here let's head back around look we got the lily out there they actually just took that house apart man i missed it this is the flagler just toured it it's a really really cool house and they got uh, that home is got two main uh bedrooms toured it last year if y'all remember it's on the channel we'll step out on the porch from that door there so don't worry we'll take another gander got another plug here and a water hookup so i stand corrected we have a little bit of a different siding right here as you could tell oh yeah the sun make our way down this way and then we i really hadn't even thought about it but we got another little porch right here our front door we're gonna walk on that let me make sure there ain't a door or anything down here to base for sure another plug another water hookup no nah, nothing over here okay all right it's time for us to head in y'all be sure to drop a like on the video if you will that'll help me out so much and then uh, subscribe and if you know somebody looking for something looking for a home in this area definitely send them this video another outlet there An <laughs> all right y'all met y'all y'all playing around too much now <laughs> full glass front door it's show time it's go time let's go Here we are, we're on the inside. And wow, this floor plan is something I think y'all are gonna really enjoy. I, I've been saying it a lot, I guess, since yesterday, I've been touring a lot of houses in the area, um, but I've seen a lot of unique floor plans. And, and I, there was a, I've, and I've been to places and I've been, and I've toured homes and stuff before and kind of all the homes you walk in, right there's your living room, kitchen on the other side, and it's just, not that, not that that's not great and, and for the right person or right set, you know, for the right family or whatever. But uh, for me, for what I like to do, I like to see unique and just crazy stuff. And so I really like this. Right here, we have this black stone. The other house I just toured had this same stone, but it wasn't black. Around the entertainment center, we have our electric fireplace. Notice right here behind where your TV or where if you had a TV, you got this shiplap here. Gonna have nine foot ceilings. And this is the LVP I just talked about in another house as well, but this is that luxury vinyl plank, waterproof right here. This stuff is a, a great flooring. And what you're gonna notice is that your marriage line, you don't have that seam, which you'll see sometimes where you just kind of scooting across each, ah, my, my big toe. No big toes were injured in the making. Nope, they ain't gotta worry about hurting that big toe no more. Okay. 
Ooh. So yeah, the power's not on. It's gonna be a little darker right in here, but we'll, we'll get some good shots, don't worry. So here's these doors off the back, and obviously they got your blinds in them that you can open and close. Raise them up. We're gonna actually raise them up, see if we can get a little more light coming in here. I'll put them down after I get done. Sweet, 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 sweet. I love your dining areas right here. It, uh, it's just kind of like a centerpiece in this house almost is kind of what I'm thinking. Hey, y'all drop a comment. I always like to hear what y'all think about the homes. Maybe some things I don't mention or some stuff that maybe you would change or whatever. Just want to hear from y'all. But yeah, let me, if I come back in here, so that couch is very comfortable looking. I'll tell you what, here we go. Oh gosh, back to work. What are you doing? <laughs> Sorry, I just had to. It just, does that couch not just look like Cullen would have a heyday in there? He loves jumping on it. But yeah, anyway, sorry about that. That was definitely not something I would typically do. I keep it very professional with videos. <laughs> sorry. But yeah, it's like the centerpiece. What I was trying to do was step back here and you can see it's just kind of, it's nice. It's real nice. All right, on with the tour. Furnace right here. into the kitchen beautiful countertops as you can tell i believe this is granite we've got our sink right here in the kitchen island with the springer faucet pull that out and give you a good shot of that undercarriage oh snap y'all y'all are y'all with me oh my gosh I'm deep breath. This looks like <laughs> 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 light on the dance will continue. <laughs> oh my gosh, I they got me. This is they got two of these setups here. That that house with two main bedrooms has this as well. I hadn't been, I hadn't really been in this house at all. I walked in, kind of looked around, just right around, peeked around the corner, and that's it. I seen the width of this right here, and I was like, okay, here we go. Boy, oh boy, this house just went from a 10 to a 12 real quick. There's your uh, built-in microwave, or I can't even talk, I can't even think. I'm, mine's blown. So we don't have power on, but you can tell we've got our lights. Let's see if I can get to there. We've got our lights here under the cabinets. we got this beautiful backsplash ceramic tile. Let me give you a close-up. Can't believe y'all did that to me. So this was a little unique. See if I can get my light down here. Hmm. See, when we came in, now let me, I know I'm backtracking. Been doing it the whole tour, I'm sorry. But when we came in, I seen those racks in there, I was like, well, that may be a pantry. I mean, that's definitely a walk-in pantry, but, uh, and, oh, goodness. I mean, is this a pantry, too? I mean, I, it could be. This is technically your utility room, and then we've got access to this back porch, which we're gonna, or side porch we're going to step on, step out on, but. Could, you could definitely have some uh, more canned good and non-perishables right there. Step out here. Wow.
I could tell whenever we started touring out there that this porch looked big, but actually being up here on it, wow. It is, it is massive. And we got two electrical outlets. So yeah, I think the ideal setup, you have this set up and then you have your back deck and you don't have a top on it. That way, if you want to be out in the sun, you can. If it's raining, you need to be under here, you can. You just, you kind of got options for whatever, you know what I'm saying? Ain't a rainy day or a sunny day, a too hot day gonna mess you up. You could do it all. Let's head back in. All right, we still got a good bit to see. Let's go ahead and make that happen. We got two bedrooms and a bath down here. Step into this bedroom. You notice we didn't go with any carpet in here. Same flooring that you're gonna see. Uh, I guess it's probably gonna be throughout this house. If it's not in these bedrooms, I wouldn't think the main bedroom's gonna have carpet. Do we got any viewers that are around this area? We got double racks, I know that door is kind of blocked. Anybody close to this? I mean, St. Augustine, y'all know, uh, is, was the first, is the oldest city in the country. <laughs> yeah, I bet you didn't know that. All right, we'll step out of there and we'll go into this bathroom. I got my light, I got my light, we'll be all right. Yeah, I mean, I'm no historian buff, but so what I'm imagining is they was coming off the, the coast over there and uh, you know, this was one of the first places that they landed. So, I mean, I would think they landed, they didn't have planes, but uh, uh, sailed into, I guess you would say. Who, who was, who was them guys, y'all know? I mean, what, who was it? And, and, and what made them want to name it St. Augustine? What? Was it, okay, was the guy's name St. Augustine? <laughs> uh, we're gonna figure this out. I'm gonna have to Google some stuff. Here is our next bedroom. See, that's the thing about these tours, you guys. We, we, we learn stuff, we tour homes. I mean, there's no telling what all is gonna happen in a tour. Uh, you know, I mean, so that it's it's so much more than just toured houses. I mean, we just had a history lesson or. All right, I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop. But we got double racks in this closet as well. This closet is a little bit smaller, but nonetheless, it's great. But you notice how like all these doors are a lot wider. I know I hadn't really even been talking about that. But all the doorways are wider. And then you're going to see some more stuff down in this main bedroom far as a shower they were telling me about it. I hadn't seen it personally but um, let's go check it out Woo. oh boy would you look at the size of that closet sure don't see that every day Oh, wait a minute, is this something right here gonna tell? <laughs> we ain't got time to, to dive off in that, I know, I'm sorry. Y'all do some Google searches for me and let me know something in the comments, I ain't sure. I ain't sure about none of that, I just, I really made all that up. I do know it's the oldest city in the United States, or town, whatever you wanna call it. Here's our walk-in closet, we've got all these built-ins. Uh, Franklin absolutely kills it with this, they've been doing it for a minute and I'm telling you, they're the best, in my opinion, when it comes to built-ins. They are the best. I don't. I hadn't seen anything else that compares. Uh, now, obviously, you you know maybe if you don't like any of this, you don't necessarily have to have this. And these are models here they order off of, so you can kind of order whatever you know, order kind of customize yourself. Nonetheless, though, it's a huge walk-in closet. Now to the main bath.
Okay. Yeah, there we go. All right, so here's what they were talking about as far as this shower. Now, Franklin has some amazing tile showers. If you didn't need this right here, then you could definitely do a beautiful tile shower right here. I've, I've toured so many, y'all. You can kind of visualize what you can put right here. But this is great to see because I've never got to tour a home with this. And I, like I said, I know I see questions all the time if these homes can be built handicap accessible or just questions about that. So there you go. I'll give you one last look right there and then I'll get in this corner. Hey, watch it. Give you a good shot of this whole bathroom. Now I will give you some good information on this home so y'all stick around for that. But before we do that, let me encourage you to go ahead and, and subscribe. Uh, like this video if you will. And then the one big thing I would love for you to do is share this home. Please share this home with someone else. I really would appreciate it. Hey everybody. Okay, so let's get into the outro. And when I was just editing the video, it really just kind of hit me, like right there at the sink and then those bathrooms, how the cabinets and stuff were, basically set up perfectly for the handicap where you would be able to pull up and you know, have the sink and stuff there. So I don't know why I was touring, when I was touring and I didn't really think about it, but uh, just keep in mind, uh, you know, that home was built specific, specifically for that reason, but you can order off of it and order it in a different, you know, not that way if you didn't need that. But actually on their website, it says model home for sale. So maybe they're looking to sell that model if you, if that's exactly what you're needing. I have information in the description. We're going to have some links in there that'll be resourceful for you. Uh, we have our website link if you want to see about getting yourself financed and pre-approvals, that type of stuff. Use that. Our members area link and then also we have um, our second channel link in there if you want to check that out uh, videos come out Tuesday Thursday and Saturday 645 Central Time I want to go ahead and get into retail estimated pricing I know it's been a rather long tour uh, this would just be what is provided to me there and obviously just like what I just mentioned depending on how you order this house uh, so many factors but one thing I would like to express or stress is that these homes, uh, these modular homes there at Florida Modular are built to Florida State Code. So Franklin, you know, they're in several other states and you potentially get this house in another state and you're looking at a lot different prices because those homes are built, uh, I know they told me up to for 160 mile an hour winds. Well, if you're in Arkansas, where I know Franklin is at as well, you don't necessarily need a house that um, at that state codes, it's not gonna be the same. So that has an impact on price as well, plus freight charges, county regulations, so many things, but this will be there for what they provided to me. And also keep in mind, they're only gonna cover their area there. there. And obviously if you are in Arkansas, then I would use our, our website link. Uh, Florida Modular Homes will not be able to service that area. But anyways, y'all know the deal for the, you, those of you that are new viewers. There you go, and this will be some estimated retail pricing at the time of recording. And you can tell it's just uh, it's just going to really depend on what all options you put in this particular model. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and step out. Hope every one of you have a wonderful rest of your day. And I would like to ask that y'all continue to pray for us because the little one is well on the way. And I'll also keep you posted on all that. Thank you so much, and I'll see you Thursday night. See ya.